Let me show you how to make this viral earth zoom effect in simple steps. For that, go to the first frame of your clip. Click on this little photo icon and make a screenshot. Go now to higgsfield.ai and look for the viral effects. There you can find the earth zoom. Click on it. Here, you can find five different styles of it. Choose the one you like the most and click on Recreate. The first thing you need to do is to delete the draft picture and upload the one we just created. Once it's uploaded, we are editing the prompt text. Since the first part of this prompt is from the other picture, we are deleting the description of the first one and create our own. You can do it by yourself or use ChatGPT for it. So delete the first part and go to ChatGPT and upload your picture there and let ChatGPT describe our screenshot. You can write, for example, describe this picture in one sentence. Once you have the description, copy it and paste it to the beginning of our prompt. Click now on Generate. This will take now a while. Grab a coffee and come back, or describe to my channel. Here you see now our effect, which is already looking crazy dope. AI is getting better and better, and we editor can benefit a lot. Download it and drag it to our timeline. The first thing we do is to reverse the clip. We want to start with the Earth first. For that, make a right-click on the clip and go to Speed and Duration. Click then on Reverse Speed. Looks way better in my opinion. Then we can start with our other clips. Since we want to start straight into another clip, I delete the clip where we made the screenshot. Just be creative now. Close the gap with the other clip. Let's pimp this clip a little bit by adding a simple speed ramp inside our Earth Zoom. With a right click on FX, you have the speed settings. Now press P on your keyboard to have the pen tool and click on the part where you want the speed ramp to start. I do my speed ramps with around 9 frames space between those little marker. Go the to the next point where you want to end the speed of the clip. Do then same now with the end part. Next, drag the speed up to around 250%. You can smooth now the parts a bit of the marker, and if you find the start of the speed to hard, you can play with the sliders a bit. When you are done, you can then drag the other footage to our effect, and look how awesome it's already looking. If you want, you can still make some adjustments on the speed till you like it. No zoom without a whoosh sound, so drag it to the earth zoom effect. You can find the zoom sound effect in the description. Go then to your project and create an adjustment layer and drag it right after our effect to the second clip and make it six frames long. You can also make right after an adjustment layer with three frames and drag this to the other clips. Next, you go to the effects panel and then open my essential pack and drag a nice shake effect with a flash on the first adjustment layer. You can find this pack in the description. I created for you guys 50 effects and transitions in this pack. Check the description and download them. Drag now the shake to the adjustment layer. And for the other adjustment layer, you can drag and drop a simple flash to it. You can copy now the flash adjustment layer and drag it to the other cuts. Make sure not to subscribe to my channel and like and comment.